Hello everyone, CES, the Consumer Electronics Show, has begun. Here are a few things that you might have missed from day one. SensorWake, a Paris-based startup, has created an alarm clock that uses intense scents to wake you up rather than using traditional noise alarms. The way that it works is you use capsules that pump out smells such as coffee, croissants, mint, and money. The clock will cost $109 and a two-pack capsule will cost $10.90, which can be used 30 times. BB-8, the friendly droid in the new Star Wars The Force Awakens movie, made by Sparrow, Sparrow? Hope I'm saying that right. Went for sale a few months ago, and now you can buy a new, new, newly released wearable band to control the droid, called the Force Band. It's really cool. It looks like a watch and is filled with sensors to allow you to control BB-8 using hand gestures, much like if you were using the Force. BB-8 costs $150, but the cost of the band hasn't been released yet. The company will be releasing a special BB-8 that has battle scars and it looks war-torn along with the band. A smart ski airbag vest has been made for those who ski a lot and fall a lot. If you do fall, an airbag will inflate within 100 milliseconds to protect you from the fall. The vest is made by a French company called In and Motion. The vest has sensors that detect movements and balance fluctuations to detect if the wearer is about to fall. Sensors also record skiers to help the company update the vest to make it safer. For right now, it retails for $1,200, so unless you ski frequently and fall frequently, you might want to wait for it to get cheaper, though this concept is really cool. Immersit, a Paris-based company, has created technology that enables your furniture, such as a sofa or a chair, to move along with what you're watching or playing on your screen. The company adds four nomadic feet to your couch or chair and with combination to air, enables it to move and jump according to what you're watching or playing. It can make your couch or chair move back and forth side to side, heave up and down, and can vibrate. There are theaters and theme parks that do use this type of technology, but now so can you. Those were some of the interesting things covered in CES. There are lots more to go. Please don't forget to subscribe and like the video and look forward to more CES coverage from us. Thank you.